But and how did you jump to then get to do it professionally? That was just a lucky, a lucky break. And I had an offer of a job, the job at BBC as a graphic mm. assistant. Mm. Um, that was still nothing to do with paint box or designing. Mm. Um, I was just anything to do with text. Yeah. So the designers say, right, on an Aston, something like that, a keyboard. Can you type up all the um, names or the credits? The credits, yeah. Mm. Um, anything static that was text-based, I had to load onto a big, big sort of like disk drive. The disks were about their size, mm. big chunky things, um, a floppy disk, and that was it. They took everything to the suite, mm. did so everything. So you pre-taped all the stuff in? Yeah, yeah, but I had no look in as to, I thought I'd be assisting this designer. Mm. I thought, mm. oh, what do you do? And can I help? Mm. But it was, Door shut. Thank you. Just type that type up. <laughs> and I thought, mm, I don't. That's just not fair. Because <laughs> I know what's behind that door, mm -hmm. and there was paint boxes. So the designers were in there, you know, working away, storyboarding, you know, bringing elements in, mm. and then they'd leave it with a pen there. They'd leave the cutout, whatever cutout they were using, ready for the next day, mm. and close the door. And it was in a suite like this with the drive I think pretty much there as well and this sort of size and I I let them go home and then I went in and I sat taught there yourself. and I and I taught myself but I had to be careful because I made sure the pen was exactly where it was and there was nothing yeah. there was no trace yeah. back to me no paper yeah. trace back to me at all I had to make sure that the you know whatever the the palette with palette was I had to put that back the last paint you know the last command was saved on that so and I did that for about um, about two years, and then. Oh my he, God! I thought you were going to say two months. <laughs> no, I just played. I just played with it every every evening. I would just when they'd gone yeah. home, and I then just what, played. A job came up. Then I then yeah. I left there because it just felt oh. so. Mm. Oh, it was just too. So you never containing. got to do the pin box there. Not no. there, no. Um, I did some freelance work, and then I uh, was offered a job at MTV. As so, a pin box artist. No, still no. not. No. <laughs> um, I had Aston and Autocue, I was brought in to do that. So I was sitting there in the gallery doing mm. two jobs at the same time. Mm. But in the next room was this, yeah. again. So I helped, I, I said I knew basics and they'd bring in freelancers, they didn't know what the machine did, I trained mm. them up. And then they did my <laughs> job. Did job. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, please let me Very go, please. Just Nobody would let me go because I was doing too much in the gallery. Mm. And also at that time, I don't know, it was just, there was only me and another person that was female. It was mm. all male. Mm. And that was another kind of... Horrible. Well, you mm. know, you should just go back and do the typing yeah. attitude. So um, it, was, it, was, it was good. So um, I then got a lucky break and got went to... I uh, was offered a position at Orbit. And so you never did it at, at MTV, MTV either? Nope. So that's three places that's, you were, two, the, where, where they two, had it. And, yeah, I couldn't, and I couldn't, couldn't get it. <laughs> and then the big jump was at Orbit, I was allowed to use uh, Paintbox, Hal mm. and Henry. So those are like the parents yeah. of this. Yeah. Yeah. This was bolted on to the, the, the Hal and the, and the Henry. And you had the ability then to go in and you could take in live video, you could animate live video, yeah. you could wrap it into 3D forms. You could take in 3D, um, work and import that and with henry you had the ability to edit so and that was a different kind of platform where you had literally like rolls of film yeah. and you can composite different layers and add different effects you could key you know it was, it was just like a whole world yeah. and they said well, would you like to come and do that and it took me about that that long the only thing was that it was in rome yeah. so that wasn't you know too hard a kind of problem to but put up quite with. nice yeah it was fantastic I, I made wonderful sort of storyboards and we did it was like no holes no 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 what's the saying no it was limitless what we could do nobody said no so we were like lighting stuff setting light to stuff under the camera mm. I did that on blue underneath which is horrendously <laughs> dangerous because it could have damaged the camera I recorded mm. it I took that in so I had real flames coming out and mm. using that as a wipe fantastic I did set light to the floor tile but we had some stuff down to put it out <laughs> so um, yeah it was it was fantastic that was and that was I mean hours and hours we'd be mm. doing it because it was like in a candy shop you had that ability to think Right, this is, their, this is the kind of idea what they'd like. And now what I'd always do, I'd always give people three concepts. 
So I'd work out storyboards and I knew the first one, I'd say, right, I reckon that's the best that I can do and give them two other options. Mm. And then they would, they had that option to say, oh, maybe we can bring that in or that in and 3D, 3D mm. elements. And then we went ahead and filmed stuff and composited it. So, I mean, it was great. It was, uh, yeah, it was a really, really exciting time. No, very few people were given the opportunity that I was mm. given mm. from fantastic. from nothing to, because it was, yeah, now, now what we've got nowadays, the, the only way to learn it was to learn it. Mm. There was no courses, mm. there was no colleges. So you had to sit there and think, well, I want it that much that I'm going to, I'm going to get it. Mm. I'm going to do it and learn it, you know, bit by bit. I remember going down to the edit suites and just watching editors with the Aston and um, laying stuff down. And I didn't know what they were doing. And I would go, why is he going backwards and forwards, man? What you, you know, just, just edit it. I didn't realize that was pre-roll and there was all these yeah. other yeah, things. I'd be like, come on, <laughs> I've got other suites to go and look after. But um, yeah, it, it, I learned, I definitely learned on the job. Self-taught all the, all the way, really.